listen one thing i know is we have to be strong and courageous in this time i'm telling you in this time in this place in the things we go through we have to be strong and courageous because i promise you listen have you ever said look god i'm, I'm coming to you and i want to be i want to be perfected in you i want you to do a new thing in me you know you're gonna be tried <laughs> you're gonna be tried by anybody anybody the enemy can use you're gonna be tried and you gotta be courageous i don't care what it is and wherever you go you're gonna be tried especially after you say that one word i'm ready lord well it's not one word it's more than one word but y'all know what i'm saying listen after you tell him that you're gonna be tried the lord is gonna allow those people around you to try you to see if you are for real are you really ready for me to do this new work in you we i'm telling y'all being strong require it, it requires you to be strong when you come to god I'm telling you, it requires you to be strong when you come to God because you're going to be tried. There are going to be many circumstances that may come against you when you do that. Especially, I'm talking like, I'm talking to everybody, but I want to tell everybody that is new to this, that is new to saying, okay, I'm coming to God. Okay, listen, it's always going to be something. It's just like, it's just like the war between the dark and the light. I'm telling you, it's just like, it's going to be some type of controversy in every situation. You got to be so courageous that you ain't going to give up. Now, I always keep saying this. It's all, it sounds so cliche that I tell you that you can't give up, okay? But I'm telling you, it's going to be some situations where you're going to be tried. Your gangster going to be tested. I'm telling you, they're going to try your gangster. What I realized is that you can run from those situations and then, you know, try to get away from it. But if you don't go through it, with courage, it's gonna keep following you. But if you're going through it and you like, you know what? I'm not letting this get the best of me. I'ma keep going, I'ma keep pushing. And, and no matter what I'm going through, no matter who's up against me, cause baby, I'm telling you, it's gonna be some people that's gonna try to call you out your name. They're gonna try to call you everything but a child of the God, child of God. I almost said a child of the King. They gonna call you everything except the child of God because it's just like that that's what the enemy does he sends his minions after you to see if he can get you to come back to his to what he's doing because i'm telling y'all it's some things that has happened when you're not doing right by the most high the, the enemy not gonna bother you but when you try when you're doing right by him the enemy does not like you he can't stand us simply because we are able to come to the Lord. We're able to be protected. We're able to be saved. We know at the end of the day, we're going to be in a glorious kingdom in heaven. When they got to be down there in the fiery furnace. Yes, they got to be down there. It's going to be some cooking down there, but it's burnt chicken down there, baby. <laughs> but listen, I just, I really just want to encourage y'all. I don't want y'all to give up on none of this. Because I remember when I first came and told God I wanted to serve him. I mean, it was glorious. It was so amazing. But, you know, shortly after, you know, the word even tells you, you have to be courageous. You have to be strong. And it said, he says, fear not. Because everywhere you go, the Lord is with you. I don't care what they do, what they say, how they try to come against you. That lawyer in the courtroom, the doctor, your, your parents, your family. They're going to try to come after you. But the Lord is, is promising you in his word that he's going to always be with you. He says, be strong. Baby, you got to power up. You got to power up. And the only way you can do that, you can power up on with your own strength. That ain't going to be enough. But you got you power up with the Lord, with Jesus Christ, Yeshua, the Holy Spirit. Y'all, it's, yeah, you're going to be okay. It's almost like you can say, I'm done. I'm giving up. This is too hard. But then the Holy Spirit kicks in and you just a whole nother, you know what I'm saying? You, a, you got a whole nother swag about you. Like, listen, the devil thought he had me. He thought my life was over. He thought by now we would give up. Shout out to Ty Trip. He thought I couldn't take no more. But you know what? God will turn your sorrows into dancing. I'm telling you, because I ain't going to lie, y'all. Ever since, I've been trying to do right. I've been tried. 
but I promise you I've been blessed as well. So you gotta count your blessings. That's why they say count your blessings. You you gonna be tried, but them blessings that be coming after that, baby, it's look it's good. It, it it's greater. God is so good, y'all. Cause no matter what, the enemy thought he was gonna have you in your grave by now, and you ain't nowhere near that. Remember that. I don't care what your circumstances is right now. You ain't in that grave. You watching me right now. I'm telling you, the strength that he gives you when you are weak. Like I said, it says, let the weak say I am strong because you are strong in him. When you begin to move forward like that, like you know that the Lord is in you, that you got an army of angels around you. When you move like that, baby, that can't stop your swag. They can't stop nothing in you. They can't stop none of that. It's literally over for them. The battle in the war has already been won. The Lord has won already. They just trying you right now. Like I told you, you're going you gonna to be tried. They're going to test your gangster. But just know that the Lord will never leave you nor forsake you. I want y'all to be courageous for real. I know that's why the Most High said that in the word a lot. If you go and look up the, the word, be courageous, be strong. He is always saying, be strong, be courageous. Because he knows that you have it in you. If he's in you, you have the strength that you need. I pray to God that you guys will never give up. Will never give up. Dear God, we thank you, Lord. I'm asking now that you would touch us and help us to be strong and powerful. To stand up to what has come against us. Knowing that the power that we have, you are in us. The power that we have is you that is in us. So we can stand up and know that the, ar the army of angels are around us. So we can know that, Lord God. Help us to have the strength. Help us to have the knowledge to know that you are with us. Make us stronger. Build us up. So that even if the biggest giant comes against us, no matter how powerful and strong something may come against us, let us know. Let us see it, Lord God. Open our eyes to see it. Show us that you are great. We know you are, Lord, but we need your assistance. We need your help. We need your comfort of the Holy Spirit to come through and give us your peace right now. Give us the strength that we need. We know that you are willing and able to do exceedingly abundantly all that we can even ask or think, Lord God. So we know now that you will come through for us. And we are trusting and believing in everything that you can do for us, Lord. So please bless us, strengthen us, make us stronger, and give us courage. Give us the knowledge and wisdom that we need. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right, guys, I'm telling y'all, drop them amens in the comments now. But listen, stay strong. You got this, baby. We in this together. We better together. Type it in the comments. We better together. I love y'all so much. Be blessed. Be courageous. Be strong. The Lord is with you. Listen, God is about to give you a complete turnaround. Things are finna get ready to miraculously turn in your favor. There's somebody watching me. You saying to yourself, I have had enough. I have seen enough. I have been through enough. And God have heard your heart. Up upon liking and sharing this, I want you to type turnaround. Because God told me to tell you there's a complete turn. My God, there's a complete turnaround, a complete shift. That's about to get ready to happen in your life. Prepare yourself. Get ready. You know, the enemy is trying to rob you of your destiny. And the only way that he succeeds is if you don't give it all you got. To complete this assignment, you got to give it all you got. This new place that God is taking you in him, it requires you to give it all you got. That means all of you has to be present. Give it all you got. So that God can be all that he is.